Welcome to the 2021 Grand Slam Club Ovis Trophy Awards presentation. Tonight, we will be honoring those men and women who have taken some incredible big game animals from around the world. Hi everybody, I'm Tom Miranda, and I'm back again to present the Grand Slam Club Ovis 2021 Rifle Trophy Awards. You know, most Grand Slam Club Ovis members are firearm hunters who travel and hunt worldwide. This awards program allows Grand Slam Club Ovis to honor its members and the great animals they harvest. The first category of the Rifle Awards will be the Bears of North America, and we'll start out with the Black Bear category first. This year's Platinum Award goes to Victor Engel for a bear he took in Alaska in June 2016, scoring 17 and 13 sixteenths SCI. The Top Diamond Award for Black Bear goes to Lonnie Cook for his 2018 bear taken in Wyoming. Lonnie's bear has an SCI score of 18 and 4 sixteenths. Now let's move on to the grizzly bears. And first up is Jeff Eno. Jeff receives the Platinum Award for his 2019 grizzly taken in Canada's Northwest Territories. Jeff's grizzly scores 24 and 3 sixteenths SCI. The Top Diamond Award goes to Justin Hasbrock for his grizzly taken in Alaska in June 2019. Justin's grizzly scores a whopping 24 and 13 sixteenths SCI. Next up is the White Bear of the North, and the Diamond Award goes to Tim Torpy for the polar bear he took in none of it, scoring 24 and 11 sixteenths SCI. Tim took his polar bear in February 2020. Now let's move into the Cougar category. The Diamond Award goes to Jason Palmer Tree for a Utah cat he took in December 2019. Jason's lion scores 14 and 5 sixteenths SCI. You know, there are five deer categories recognized in our North American Rifle Trophy Awards. The Whitetail, Mule Deer, Columbia Blacktail, Sitka Blacktail, and the Desert Cow's Whitetail. Let's start out with the Desert Cows, or some people call it the Coos Whitetail. The Gold Award this year is presented to James Zemer for the cow's deer he took in January 2019, scoring 80 and 5 8 SCI. Dennis Schemel receives the Platinum Award for a desert buck he took in January 2017, scoring 89 and 6 8 SCI. The Top Diamond Award goes to Lonnie Cook for a cow's deer buck he took in Mexico in January 2019. Lonnie's buck has an SCI score of 100 and 3 8 Now let's move on to the mule deer. Kenneth Davis is presented the Gold Award for his Utah muley taken in September 2016. Kenneth's buck has a typical SCI score of 192 and 7 8 this year's Platinum Award for Mule Deer goes to Gordon Nelson for a buck he took while hunting in Colorado in November 2019. Gordon's buck has a typical SCI score of 201 and 5 8. The Top Diamond Award for Mule Deer goes to Ralph Adams. Ralph took this great buck in Mexico in January 2020 with a typical SCI score of 208 and 1 8. This year in the Sitka Blacktail category, we have a unique situation. The Gold, Platinum, and Diamond Awards all go to Jeremy Rusink for the great bucks he submitted. Rusink's Gold Award buck was taken in November 2019 and has an SCI score of 103 and 08. Jeremy's Platinum Award buck was taken in December 2018 and has an SCI score of 103 and 48 and Jeremy's top Diamond Award Sitka Blacktail was taken in December 2019, which has an SCI score of 110 and 7 8. Great job, Jeremy. Now let's move into the Columbia Blacktail. This year's Bronze Award goes to James Zemer for a California buck he took in September 2019, scoring 95 and 5 8 SCI. Robert Newland Jr. was hunting in Oregon in October 2020 when he took this buck, which earns him the Silver Award. 
Roberts Buck has an SCI score of 95 and 6 8. The Gold Award is presented to Dennis Schemel for the Oregon Buck he took in October 2018, which scores 108 and 2 8 SCI. Jason Palmertree took this Oregon buck in November 2016 to earn the Platinum Award. Jason's buck scores 116 and 6 eighths SCI. Jeff Damaski is presented the Top Diamond Award for his Columbia Blacktail. Jeff's Oregon buck scores a whopping 166 and 1 8 SCI. Let's move on now to the Rocky Mountain Elk. Grand Slam Club Ovis member Dennis Schemel hunted in Alberta in September 2019, harvesting this bull with a typical SCI score of 307 and 1 8, earning Dennis the Bronze Award. This year's Silver Award for Rocky Mountain Elk goes to Nicholas Saner. Nicholas took this great Wyoming bull in November 2018, and his bull taped out at 351 and 1 8 SCI. Next up is Braden Soroka for the Rocky Mountain Elk he took while hunting in Alberta. Braden's bull earns him the gold award with an SCI score of 351 and 5 8. The Platinum Award goes to David Bloom for a Utah bull he took in September 2019. David's elk scores 354 and 0 8 SCI. The Top Diamond Award goes to Wendell Crow for his New Mexico elk harvested in October 2017. Wendell's bull scores 357 and 3 8 SCI. In the Roosevelt elk category, this year the silver award goes to James Zemer for his Northern California bull taken September 2019. James' bull scores 306 and 4 8 SCI. Chad Lenz has presented the gold award for his October 2020 bull taken in British Columbia. Chad's rosy bull scores 333 and 0 8 SCI. The Platinum Award goes to Wendell Crow for a bull he took in September 2019 while hunting in California. Wendell's bull scores 340 and 7 8 SCI. And this year's Top Diamond Award for Roosevelt Elk goes to Dennis Schemel for his 2017 Northern California Bull. Dennis's bull has an SCI score of 377 and 3 8. Now let's move to California's Thule Elk and James Zemer's 2019 Bull that earns him the Bronze Award with a score of 229 and 3 8 SCI. The Silver Award for California's Thule Elk goes to David Houghton for a Thule Bull he took in 2019. David's bull scores 235 and 3 8 SCI. Milton Schultz Jr. has earned the Gold Award for a Thule Bull he harvested in 2017. Milton's bull scores 254 and 3 8 SCI. For the Platinum Award, we once again recognize Dennis Schemel. Dennis harvested this California Thule in July 2018 and has scored 255 and 1 8 SCI. Grand Slam Club Ovis member Larry Day will receive the Top Diamond Award for his August 2020 Thule Bull which scores 273 and 5 8 SCI. Now we move to North America's Caribou and we'll start off with the Mountain Caribou. Jerry Smith is up first to receive the Platinum Award for his Mountain Caribou Bull taken in Canada's Northwest Territories in September 2018. Jerry's bull scores 355 and 5 8 SCI. The Top Diamond Award for the Mountain Caribou is presented to Dennis Schemel. Dennis took his Yukon Bull in August 2017, scoring a whopping 408 and 0 8 SCI. Up next is the Woodland Caribou. And again, Dennis Schemel receives the Top Diamond Award for his Woodland Bull, harvested in October 2017, 
scoring 305 and 6 eighths SCI. In the Quebec Labrador Caribou category, yep, it's once again Dennis Schemel to receive the Diamond Award for his bull taken in September 2017. Dennis's Quebec Labrador bull has an SCI score of 332 and 4 eighths. In the Barren Ground Caribou category, Todd Hofteiser earns the Platinum Award for an Alaskan bull he took in August 2017. Todd's caribou bull scores 295 and 7 eighths SCI. The top diamond award for the Barren Ground Caribou goes to Chad Savage Lens for his bull harvested in August 2020. Chad was hunting in the Yukon Territory and his caribou has an SCI score of 463 and 2 eighths. Awesome job, Savage. There are three moose subspecies recognized for the Grand Slam Club Ovis North American Trophy Awards. The Alaskan Yukon Moose, the Canadian Moose, and the Shiras Moose. First up is the Canadian. The gold award for the Canada Moose is presented to Jerry Smith for his British Columbia Bull that had an SCI score of 364 and 0 eights. Larissa Switlick receives the Platinum Award for a bull she took in October 2016, scoring 414 and 4 eighths SCI. And the Diamond Award is presented to Chris Maxwell for an Alberta bull he took in 2020. Chris's bull scores a whopping 485 and 6 eighths SCI. Let's move on to the Alaskan Yukon Moose. Chad Lenz will receive the gold award for his Yukon bull taken in August 2020. Chad's bull scored 428 and 0 eighths SCI. The platinum award goes to Jerry Smith for a bull he took in Canada's Northwest Territories in 2018. Jerry's bull moose scores 453 and 5 eighths SCI. Mark Farnham is presented the Top Diamond Award for his Yukon Giant, taken in September 2020, a bull that scored a whopping 522 and 3 eighths SCI. Wow, congratulations, Mark. Well, there's only one Shiras Moose Award this year, and the diamond goes to Rick Frazier for his Southern Alberta Shiras Moose. Rick's bull scores 326 and 4 eighths SCI. Okay, let's move on to the bison category. And of course, these animals are also commonly referred to as buffalo. This year's gold award for bison is presented to Robert E. Mays Jr. for his bull taken in 2016, which scored 51 and 3 eighths SCI. Jason Palmer Tree earns the platinum award for his bison bull taken in December 2018, that scored 63 and 4 eighths SCI. And the top diamond award for bison is presented to George Bierman for a bison bull he took in February 2020. George's bull scores 63 and 5 eighths SCI. Next up is the mountain goat. Now, as you know, the American mountain goat can also be entered for the Grand Slam Club Ovis Capra Trophy Awards. But when you enter in that category, it also competes with Capra goats from around the world. For the North American Big Game Trophy Awards, the American Mountain Goat has its own category. First up for the Bronze Award is Jeff Woodley for his Alaskan goat taken in September 2016. Jeff's Billy has an SCI score of 24 and 7 eighths. Todd Hofteiser is presented the Silver Award for a goat he took in Alaska in 2019. Todd's Mountain Billy scores 26 and 5 eighths SCI. Up next is Dale Hislop, who earns the gold award for his Alaskan Billy taken in October 2019. Dale's goat scores 27 and 6 eighths SCI. The Platinum Award for Mountain Goat is presented to Jeremy Rusink for his Alaskan Billy, which scored 31 and 1 eighth SCI. The top diamond award goes to Lonnie Cook for a British Columbia goat he harvested in September 2019. Lonnie's Billy has an SCI score of 31 and 4 eighths. 
The last category for the North American Trophy Awards is the pronghorn. And the diamond award in the pronghorn category goes to David Henderson. David took this huge speed goat in New Mexico in August 2019, and his goat scored a whopping 88 and 4 eighths SCI. Well, this concludes the Rifle North America Trophy Awards for 2021, but there's much more to come. First up are our North America Rifle Sheep Awards. And as you know, for all North American Sheep Awards, we present separate plaques to the hunter and the outfitting company. The first North American Sheep category will be for the Doll Sheep. The minimum score for this category is 160 SCI. The Top Diamond Award for 2021 in the Doll Sheep category goes to Dixon Outfitters and their hunter, Louis Breland, for his Alaskan Doll Sheep taken in August 2020. Louis's Ram scores 184 and 6 eighths SCI. Now we move to the Stone Sheep category. The Top Diamond Award for 2021 in the Stone Sheep category goes to Tony Caligiri for his stone ram taken in British Columbia in August 2018, a ram that scored 175 and 6 eighths SCI. Now let's move along to the California Bighorn category and first call Okanagan Outfitters and Tony Caligiri to receive the Platinum Award for a ram Tony took in Idaho in August 2020. That ram has an SCI score of 169 and 6 eighths. Ralph Adams has presented the Top Diamond Award for his August 2020 California Bighorn taken in Nevada. This outstanding ram has an SCI score of 170 and 3 eighths. Okay, now let's move into the Desert Bighorn category. You know, each ram that qualifies with a minimum of 168 SCI will receive an award. Now there's several hunters receiving bronze awards then we'll move into the silver, gold, platinum, and diamond awards. Go With Bow Booking and Guide Service and Nick Sanner will receive the first bronze award for the Desert Bighorn Nick took in Mexico during March 2020. Nick's Ram scores 169 and 7 eighths SCI. Next up for a bronze award is Bobby Thies. His Desert Bighorn was taken in Texas in March 2020, scoring 171 and 2 eighths SCI. Go With Bow Booking and Guide Service and Jim Lines will receive a bronze award for the Desert Bighorn Jim took in Texas in June 2016. Jim's Ram scores 172 and 6 eighths SCI. Otto Walters is presented a bronze award for his Desert Bighorn taken in Arizona in December 2019 with an SCI score of 174 and 4 eighths. Up next for a bronze award is David Sturk for a Desert Bighorn he took in California in October 2019. David's Ram scores 179 and 0 eighths SCI. Tony Caligiri is presented a bronze award for the Desert Bighorn he took in Coahuila, Mexico in November 2018. Tony's Ram has an SCI score of 180 and 4 eighths. The Silver Award in the Desert Bighorn category is presented to Go With Bow Booking and Guide Service and Hunter Brad Black. Brad's Mexican Ram was taken in March 2020 and scores 181 and 4 eighths SCI. The Gold Award is presented to Ruben Sarian. Ruben took his Ram in California in December 2018. Ruben's Ram has an SCI score of 181 and 6 eighths. Arnie Pitts receives the Platinum Award for his Desert Bighorn taken in Nevada in November 2019. Arnie's Ram scores 185 and 3 eighths SCI. Now the top diamond award for Desert Bighorn, believe it or not, is a tie. The first award goes to Jeff Damaski for a Desert Bighorn he took in Coahuila, Mexico in October 2019. The second diamond award goes to Tom Musa for a ram he took in Sonora, Mexico in February 2020. 
both Rams score a whopping 194 and 2 8 SCI. The final category for this year's North American Sheep Trophy Awards is for the Rocky Mountain Bighorn. To qualify, the Ram must score a minimum of 180 SCI. The Silver Award goes to Larry Day for his Rocky Mountain Bighorn taken in British Columbia, November 2017. Larry's Ram scores 180 and 3 8 SCI. Jeff Swigart receives the Gold Award for his Wyoming Ram scoring 181 and 0 8 SCI. Jeff took his fine ram in September 2019. The Platinum Award is presented to Tucannon Outfitters and Hunter Enrique Fernandez for his fine Rocky Mountain Bighorn taken in Oregon, November 2018. Enrique's ram scores 186 and 5 8 SCI. Mike Carpenito gets the Top Diamond Award for his October 2019 Rocky Mountain Bighorn taken in Montana. Mike's outstanding Ram scores 193 and 2 8 SCI. And this completes the North American Wild Sheep Trophy Awards. Now, a word from our great sponsors. I'm Chad Lenz with Savage Encounters. This year we've donated a few hunts to Grand Slam Club Ovis. Doing our part in conservation. You should come up and join us on a spectacular adventure in the Savage Academy, Alberta, Canada. Uh, Good job. Get, get him. Get him. He's not moving for Right on the shoulder. My first bull moves. Oh, a, Chad, you're the man. Thank you very much. You That's a great moment. Incredible man. Look at that. Oh. Big boy. Matt. Yes! Look at this. My Alberta mule deer buck right there. Thinking about putting some baits out for some hunters to come up and join me on a good wolf hunt. Take home a spectacular fur and a beautiful mount. In the wilds of Alberta, I've donated a hunt to Grand Slam Club Ovis this year. I do most years and uh, in my effort to support conservation, and I hope you guys will bid her up high and support conservation with us. We are designers. We are craftsmen. We push the limits of modern day technologies. What better test of our trade than to breathe new life into your old rifle or shotgun? 
We are Starksmiths. Boyd's Hardwood Gun Stocks. Okay, here we go with the International Introduced category. Just as the name of this category states, these animals have been introduced as non-indigenous species. The International Introduced category is designed for completely free-ranging wild sheep or wild capra goats from anywhere in the world. The Bronze Award in the International category is presented to Lyle Wood for a red sheep harvested in Texas, October 2016. Lyle's Red Sheep scored 113 and 7 eighths SCI. Sergei Yastremsky is up next to receive the Silver Award for a Red Sheep he took in June 2016. Sergei was hunting in Texas and his Ram scores 116 and 4 eighths SCI. The Gold Award in this category is presented to Craig Van Arsdale for an odd ad he took on a 2019 self-guided hunt in Texas Craig's Ram has an SCI score of 139 and 08. Up next is James Cropsey and his New Mexico Audad, taken in December 2019, with an SCI score of 145 and 08. This fine Ram earned James the Platinum Award. The Diamond Award for International Introduced goes to Kevin Williams for his New Zealand tar harvested in June 2018. Kevin's tar scores 43 and 3 eighths SCI. And this completes our international introduced category. Now let's move along to the international capra category. Make note that the winners for this category, as well as the international sheep category, are chosen by an international panel of judges. The criteria includes the quality and rarity of the trophy, as well as the difficulty of the hunt. The Bronze Award is presented to Mike Monin for his Gobi Ibex, taken in Mongolia in October 2018. Mike's Ibex scores 110 and 7 eighths SCI. Next is the Silver Award, and it's presented to Lyle Wood for a Himalayan tar he harvested in Nepal in April 2018. Lyle's tar measures 45 and 5 eighths SCI. Christian Soberg earns the gold award for his Dagestan tur harvested in Azerbaijan in June 2018. 
Kristen's Tur measures 170 and 3 8 SCI. The Platinum Award is presented to Peggy Barnett Lee for her Bukharan Markor taken in Tajikistan in October 2019. That Markor measures 121 and 0 8 and ranks number one in the SCI record book. The Diamond Award goes to Edward Mossbrook for an American mountain goat he harvested in Alaska in September 2018. Ed's incredible goat scores a whopping 32 and 3 8 SCI. Now we move along to the international sheep category. Remember that just as with the international capper category, the winners are chosen by a panel of international judges. The criteria includes the quality and rarity of the trophy, as well as the difficulty of the hunt. The Bronze Award is presented to Jim Lines for the Hume Argali he harvested in Kyrgyzstan in October 2019. Jim's Ram scores 208 and 4 8 SCI. The Silver Award is also presented to Jim Lines for his Tian Shan Argali harvested in Kyrgyzstan in October 2019. Jim's Ram has an SCI score of 204 and 7 8. Brian Harlan is presented the Gold Award for his Chakotka Snow Sheep taken in Russia in August 2018. Brian's Ram scores 161 and 5 8 SCI. For the Platinum Award, we have a tie. The first Platinum belongs to Jesus Viejo Gonzalez for his December 2019 Severitsov Argali taken in Uzbekistan. Jesus's great ram has an SCI score of 150 and 2 eighths and is number one in the SCI record book. The second platinum award goes to Brian Harlan for his Gobi Argali taken in Mongolia September 2018. Brian's ram scores 215 and 3 eighths SCI. The diamond award goes to Charles Weibel for his Gobi Argali harvested in Mongolia in August 2019. Charles's Argali has an SCI score of a whopping 238 and 7 eighths and is number one in the SCI record book. Now, a word from our great sponsors.
I'm Jimmy Sykes, producer and host of the Spiritual Outdoor Adventures television series. We are on the Pursuit Channel and on other networks across the world, and we're about to launch season 20. Now that means I've been doing this for a very long time. And one of my favorite outfitters to work with is Iber Hunting in Europe. Iber Hunting is presenting a special European hunting and vacation tour starting in the year 2022. This amazing adventure will take place on the beautiful continent of Europe in four different countries, Austria, the Czech Republic, Italy, and Spain. You start in Madrid, I've been there, it's awesome. And you end in Venice, been there too, very romantic. Wow, what a trip. And in each European country, your guide will help you find a wide range of game species in their natural environments that will vary from one region to another. In this combo hunting and leisure tour, you'll have the opportunity to hunt the amazing Ibex in Spain, the elusive chamois in the mountains of Austria, and the large deer and mouflon rams in Central Europe. The trip includes 18 days of both hunting and touring points of historical interest with tour guides that know the history and love to tell the stories of the region. If you choose to add additional game species to your hunt, you can do that. I hope that you'll have the opportunity to hunt in the ancient tradition of these historic countries and enjoy the beautiful European cities and people. Book your trip right now for these adventures that begin in 2022 with Ivor Hunting. Juan and Pablo from Spain. We are hunting in the end of August and in Cabardino Valcaria. We are hunting mid Caucasian tour and this is the third day of hunt. We had many opportunities before but uh, we tried to choose the, the big, the biggest and the oldest animal. These are the two that we saw today and, and we shot them and we were very lucky. The experience is great. Uh, we are very happy, happy with the guides, with um, the Russian people that meet us, and, and I really recommend this hunt to, to everyone, especially with Profi Hunt. Thank you very much. Well, this concludes all of our trophy award presentations for 2021, and Grand Slam Club Ovis is very pleased, as am I, to honor all these recipients.